Hello, welcome to Practice Bits. These three ideas are playing the G major chord, the open chord, in a bass drum pattern, a G major pentatonic scale lick, and an E minor pentatonic scale lick, and we can combine these together. Let's get to it. Okay, we will start with the G major chord played in a bass drum pattern. So that's simply the G open G chord. Play the bass note first, the sixth string, and then strum the chord. Pretty simple. That's the first idea. The second idea was the G major pentatonic scale lick, which is this. Sliding up into the first note, which is the fourth fret of the third string. Okay, that's idea number two. Again, simple by itself. Third idea was an E minor pentatonic lick, which is this. Just going backwards through the E minor pentatonic scale. Okay, so here's what it sounds like when we start to combine them. I'm going to speed it up and I can combine those in all sorts of combinations. I can do just bass strum. some different combinations and eventually I will start to improvise in and around those so I was gonna improvise a little bit and this is what it will begin to sound like after you practice it for a while on that one I did the E minor pentatonic first after the G bass drum um... That's it. Simple little practice bit. And then you can combine this with other ideas in G. You can find three different ideas, practice those, and then start mixing them all together. And pretty soon you can be all over the fretboard with some practice. <laughs>